Hello friends, this is Akshay from Simple Techie Artist and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to draw a black panther and the photograph was taken by famous wildlife photographer Sa Zhang and this photo was taken in Kabani, Karnataka and uh, we were going to draw this using a very simple uh, printer paper and before drawing we have taken some measurement using scale and then we will draw a rough outline uh, like a circular face which is used for a cat like animal and then we are going to draw the uh, eyes and the different curve inside the face of the black panther and then we will draw its uh, body and the tree on which it sits and then we will color it using the oil pastel from doms and camel and mostly we will use uh, three pastels black, gray and white because we are going to draw only the light shades on, on the panther's uh, skin and then we will draw some portion of the tree and leaves and then we will uh, draw the background friends observe here we start the color with the light prominent areas and then we'll start working on the dark areas so in the more enlightened areas we'll start working with the gray pastel and the, some portion in the white pastel and then eventually on the darker areas we'll start with the black and deep brown pastel because a combination of black and deep brown will reflect the uh, texture of the fur and the shade of the light on it. Now after the grey we will start with the deep brown because you know when the light reflect on black fur and the reflection is not 100% black it's, it's brownish the hair look like or the fur look like brownies so we actually imply the same concept here so uh, friends uh, on in drawing uh, the main uh, thing is observation and the knowledge of light and shadow and uh, the various curves on on face on body and the shades on those uh, so just observe and watch till the end so in the black fur how we created the different texture different curves using the gray and brown and black only now we start working on the uh, darker parts using the black pastel and then eventually we'll mix it with gray and brown then the proper uh, texture and the shades will come then we'll start blending it uh, we, I use finger sometimes and the sometimes blending stumps to blend the things and in the larger areas we use tissue paper and in very small parts you may use earbuds or you may use very small and very uh, thin blending stumps so it all depends on which portion you want to blend and how much area you want to blend so let's start with the eyes now we in the black panther eyes the portion of yellow is very small and then we will draw the irises and the shadow of eyebrows on eyes uh, using some black watercolor pencils so it blends good in on the oil pastels and we will also leave some areas white to make the eye lively and uh, it looks good um, and make the picture more realistic so guys if you draw a very hyper realistic painting then the things these kind of things you need to learn and you need to try to add more perfection to your painting uh, using these methods and then it will look like a realistic painting and eventually when you achieve more perfection it will look like hyper realistic so like every hair of the far is distinctively visible the eyes are vivid and live so this kind of cool uh, 
features you can add to your painting more and more you learn and practice more and more you will achieve so we start with the body of the black panther it's also the play of light and shadow with gray and black and then we will blend the colors using the blending stamps and then we will draw the leaves on the tree and then we will paint the portion of the branch of the tree which is visible here and on which this panther was sitting and then we will uh, paint the background which is mostly out of focus so it's, it's just a jungle in uh, sunlight so we will use mostly light yellow and light green and we will blend it using the tissue paper as there is no visible prominent object uh, it could be seen there it's mostly out of focus as we are finishing this painting i would like to share some words about this black panther his name is saya and he lives in kabini karnataka and the wildlife photographer saz zan is observing him for last five years it's a melanistic leopard and one and single of its race which we found in the forest of Nagarhol in India. Nature always gives us surprises and thanks to the wildlife photographer we came to know about this majestic creature in the forest of India. Thanks for watching guys and please subscribe my channel for having more videos like this. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Meet you again.